Hello, I'm Brian Motes, and I'd like to share with you some information about the readings for this coming Sunday, May 5th, the sixth Sunday after Easter. This Sunday's image of the life of the risen Christ shares with us is the image of friendship. We are called to serve others as Jesus came to serve. Friendship captures the love, the joy, the deep mutuality of the relationship into which Christ invites us. The Greeks believed that true friends are willing to die for each other. This is the mutual love of Christian community commanded by Christ and enabled by the Holy Spirit. The first reading comes from Acts chapter 10. While Peter shares the good news of Jesus with a Gentile soldier and his family, the Holy Spirit comes upon them. Recognizing that the Spirit works inclusively in the lives of both Jews and Gentiles, Peter commands that these Gentiles also be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. Our second reading comes from the first John chapter 5. Here God's children believe that Jesus is the Messiah and love God by keeping God's commandments. Thus the world is conquered not through military might, but through love and faith. For the love of God is this, that we obey his commandments, and his commandments are not burdensome. For whatever is born of God conquers the world, and this is the victory that conquers the world our faith. Who is it that conquers the world but the one who believes that Jesus is the Son of God? The Gospel comes from John chapter 15. On the night of his arrest, Jesus delivers a final testimony to the disciples to help them in the days ahead. Here he repeats the most important of his commands, that they love one another. Jesus says, As the Father has loved me, so I have loved you. Abide in my love. If you keep my commandments, you will abide in my love, just as I have kept my Father's commandments, and abide in his love. I have said these things to you, so that my joy may be in you, and that your joy may be complete. This is my commandment, that you love one another, as I have loved you. You did not choose me, but I chose you. And I appointed you to go and bear fruit, fruit that will last, so that the Father will give you whatever you ask in my name. I am giving you these commands, so that you may love one another. Let's love one another this week. See you Sunday. Thank you.